Hi everyone, welcome to The Grace Life. So as you can see here, we are having some lightning, torrential rains, but yeah, all in all, God is so good. Now let's reflect this morning. We are going to be talking about I am complete. It's easy to look in the mirror and to notice every flaw about you. If you want to feel bad about yourself, then compare your looks to the top models, your intelligence to the top minds, and your relationship with God to the great leaders of faith. Yet, while you may not be able to compare, when you focus on the brilliant minds, the most attractive people, and the most devout believers, you will shift your focus to Christ, the creator of the universe. You will find they don't even come close to his perfection. Stop comparing the Goliath in your life with the shepherd boy David that you see in the mirror. Instead, do what David did and compare your greatest obstacle to God. Because when you compare anything to God, no matter how big it is, God is bigger still. Amen. You are complete in Christ. Where you are weak, he is strong. And where you have failed a thousand times, with him you will overcome. When you are sick, he makes you whole. And when your heart is broken, his love knits it back together. When you have no more fight left, he's your endurance that picks you up and carries you across the finish line. So who is our God? He's the forgiver of sins, emotional and physical healer. He's a constant companion through every trial, protector from all danger. He is everything that you need. You've been made a child of the Almighty, freed from everything holding you back, and have a promise of a bright future. All this is given to you through the death and resurrection of Christ so that you can be complete. Now believe it, no matter what your insecurities uh, that you have in your battle, what obstacle is in front of you and how inadequate you feel, how big your mistakes are with God, you are ready and equal to anything. You are complete in Him and only Him. So I speak these words over your life and mine. My salvation is a gift. This is a reality. There is nothing that I did, nothing that I can do to improve it. I was broken and empty before I met Jesus. But when I accepted Jesus as a personal savior, he came into me filling all the gaps of my inadequacies, imperfections, and flaws. He filled my emptiness with his love, my loneliness he filled with his friendship, my weakness with his strength, my failures with his forgiveness, my worries with his peace, and my stress with his joy, my sickness with his healing, my inability with his ability, my insecurity with his confidence, and my fears with his faith. Any area in which I come up short, when it comes to my own ability, God makes up the difference with his ability. I am complete because Christ is in me and he is with me. Amen.
I hope that these days of reflect encourage you. So I encourage you to go ahead and ask you to share this with somebody else who might need this today. So I do hope you enjoyed the video and I hope that you share it with someone who needs this message today. If you like the video, click like, share and comment and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every single time I upload a video. I hope your day is favored and blessed. Have an amazing one, guys.